Hey all my shining stars, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. Today is empties day. I made it a point, I am fresh off from work, I'm sitting on my couch so I'm kind of relaxed, forgive me, but this video needed to be done. I have had some empties accumulating for quite some time. They have just been sitting here waiting for me to record this video. So I figured let me go ahead, get this done, knock it out of the way so that I can recycle, trash these um, empties that I have here. Um, I have some of my mom's and I think I've mixed everything together. Um, if you guys know in one of my previous videos, I had let you know that I moved um, recently, but about a, a month ago, I guess. Um, and so... Yeah, I've had some of hers and I've had some of mine. If I remember who's, what is, you know, who's uh, empties, then I'll let you guys know. But yeah, let me just go ahead and knock these out of the way. Um, so without further ado, we're going to go ahead and get started. This is a dial gold bar. As you can tell, I think I had a four, six, or eight pack. Probably not eight, maybe four or six. So when I um, took them out of the packaging, I just wrote on the box. I don't know if you guys can see that or not, but I just wrote on the box gold bar so I would know which dial bar it was because you know they have other ones that I've tried and that I've purchased before and used as well. But this is the gold bar. Um, I believe this is it is antibacterial, so I do like this. I would repurchase, um, so there's that. This is a Clorox disinfecting wipes. My mom and I both use these, but I want to say these were mine. And they look like this. Um, as I've told you guys plenty of times, um, these Lysol disinfectant spray, Clorox wipes, Lysol wipes, I will continue to use. We both will, so that's empty. This is the Tide Hygienic Clean Heavy 10 Times Duty. Um, I want to say I did purchase this from Target, but of course, Walmart and Target both sell this. This was okay. Um, I don't know. what. One thing I will say about Tide is that for many years, um, I have used Tide, and it just doesn't really... Now, don't get me wrong. I do believe Tide detergent will absolutely get your clothes clean they will um lift and re release and remove stains from your clothes things like that oxy um i don't know if i have an empty of that right now but i use that in my laundry as well todd doesn't really have that like a scent that i feel like it should, laundry should have i guess you know um, it's just like a basic, regular smell. And for that, I have never really honestly been the biggest fan of Tide. Um, when I do laundry, I like to be able to smell. Like, have some type of, like, fresh... I mean, this is a fresh scent, but I don't know. I'm, I really buy Arm & Hammer. I don't know if I have one of those in here or not. But I really find myself purchasing the Arm & Hammer Fresh Burst quite a bit. And so I love the smell of that. Like it has a more stronger scent smell than Tide does. But I mean, Hygienic Clean, I guess it's okay. I'm not saying I would never use it again, but I also use either Clorox or Lysol sanitizer, laundry sanitizer in my laundry as well. So if I wanted it, them to be clean or get rid of germs, and I just wanted that extra boost of confidence that I could use one of those instead of this. But this was okay. It wasn't horrible. I just don't know if it would be my go-to detergent all the time. Okay. This is something that I purchased quite a few times and I would repurchase again. This is the Shout um, for stains, um, laundry stain remover. And this is the one that's free of add, no added dyes or fragrances. So this is that. I've purchased this several times. I would continue to repurchase. This is a Game Power Blast. This is the one um, with the pump, that the sprayer that you use for your dishes. As you can see, 
Um, I don't know if you can tell, but this was the clearance tag on Target. I really didn't know why this was on clearance. I've never seen this or the Dawn dish spray on clearance before. But I found, I think when I was using it, that something in the pump or this, and it was closed tightly. I always made sure of that, but it would leak. It would leak the spray. And so for that, I don't know where the problem was. So I'm just going to throw this away. I mean, if you purchase these and you use these in your kitchen or cleaning or on your dishes, you know that the refills in this actual spray bottle is probably around the same price. So you're really not saving that much if you don't purchase this and you just purchase the refill. I just really don't find it's that much of a difference. But hey, this was leaking, so I'm not going to keep this pump. But it was on clearance, $3.28, and that really probably isn't even a real big difference from the normal price of this. So whatever. This is a Febreze Small Spaces. I, want, I use these in my car. Um, tip and trick, if you guys don't already do it, most of you may. But I put these small spaces under the seats in my car. And that's my car air freshener. Most of the time, I don't do the plug-ins. I definitely don't do the Bath & Body Works um, visor and vent clips. But I use these small spaces under my seats. And it will last at least 30 days or more. You will smell the scent. And it will be in your car. This one just happens to be ocean um, scent. Scent note is ocean. I mean, the scent is ocean, and scent notes are hinoki, ginger, and water lily. I really like this scent, and I like. Is that Febreze? Never mind. I like fresh, but I think that's Unstoppable's. I don't know, whatever. But this is the Febreze, and this is in ocean. So I got through that. I go through these quite a bit. I always tell you guys, you can use this sensitive, Dove Sensitive Skin Bar for pretty much anything um, on your body. No, no fragrance. So that's one of those. I probably have more of these in here, but this is one. Actually, I lied. Here's another one. So that's two. Um, I actually do buy the Sensitive Skin Dove Bars in bulk when I go to Sam's Club, so I do shop at Sam's. Um, you guys probably hear me talk about or mention Sam's Club a lot. So, yeah. I don't, I didn't use this. This must be my mom. So, this is the Sensodon Pro Namel Gentle Whitening Toothpaste. Yeah, so she didn't give me the tube. This is just the box, and it looks like this. So, I didn't use this, so I'm pretty sure this is my mom's. I really... I didn't ask her, so I'm not going to tell y'all a lot, but I am quite sure, um, I'm almost positive that she uses this toothpaste pretty much. This is her go-to toothpaste, so I'm sure she likes it because she continues to repurchase it, so there's that. This is a Dawn dishwashing liquid, and this is in the Apple Blossom scent. I don't know. I'm an Apple scent fan, okay, so... I um I remember loving this. Um I'm not um very particular with the scents when it comes to the Dawn dish liquid, but like I said, I am an apple scent fan, so I'm I pretty much love this and I wanted to try something other than the regular Dawn, the regular one in the blue color. So that's that and this is the squeeze bottle. So you know, you just sit it like this, squeeze it out in your dish liquid, I mean dish water and wash your dishes so that's empty this is i always make noise with this <laughs> packaging when i'm trying to talk to you guys but this is one of the fragrance free um wipes it has aloe and vitamin e that i i, I religiously always purchase these all the time these come from walmart this is the Equate brand, everyday clean i use these in the bathroom this packaging has 80 wipes now the last time i went to walmart i will say i tried to find um a package of these that had multiple packs in them but i wasn't successful so i don't think they sell these other than in the one package so what i did was i purchased some huggy ones um you guys will probably see them in an empties um in the future 
but they had three packs of these in one pack and i think it was like maybe five or six bucks and i'm using those currently really don't see a difference between the huggies ones and these they're both fragrance free and they both have aloe and vitamin e but i mean i would always repurchase these these i love these i use these in the bathroom um they are not flushable but i don't care about that it does say do not flush on the packaging but like i said that doesn't bother me i will still continue to use them this is a uh, miel i don't know if people pronounce this different miel miel however you want to say it but this is the i'm not even gonna butcher that word but and mint this is something in mint <laughs> deep conditioner it has protein and moisture to replenish your dry and damaged hair so this is a deep conditioner um but this is it looks like this and so this is empty i use this obviously on wash days it does have a very minty scent to it um i really think it did help i mean when i did use it as a deep conditioner i mean i probably would repurchase i think this is a pretty good deep conditioner for all my natural girlies or whoever really you don't even have to be natural but even if you know if you want to try it out i think this was a pretty good one and i probably would purchase and try it again next we have this urban skin rx this is the clear skin cleansing bar three in one treatment it looks like this if you guys can see it or maybe not so it looks like that it these it's three different bars there's the white one which is the clear skin there's the green colored one which is even tone and then there's an orange one i believe which is combination skin um, and then this is the jar. So basically, if you've purchased these or you've used this before, it deep cleans pores and oily, blemish-prone skin. Um, you know, it's the bar inside, and then it comes with a sponge, but I always purchase more from Amazon because who wants to keep... That's not very hygienic or um, sanitary to keep using the same sponge and washing your face daily with the same one. So I purchased them from Amazon and I use a different one every day when I would use this. This is good. It's not my first time using it. Um, I do enjoy it. I do have other um, facial cleansers that I'm trying out. Um, but I would repurchase this and try again. Like I said, this is not my first one. I've tried this in the past before. So I do like it and I think it's pretty good. This is a 50% rubbing alcohol in the winter green. Um, I think this was my mom's, and I'm not going to lie to you guys. I don't know exactly what she uses it for, but I know I use it for mosquito bites, okay? Like, if I get insect bites or mosquito bites, and I mean, because, you know, when I visit my mom... You know, or, you know, where we live in the country, we're in the country area, so mosquitoes are like a dime a dozen out here. And, you know, when I visit or when I go home, I know they always are like fresh meat and they are, you know, they are all over me, no lie. So I use alcohol for that. I can also use Neosporin, cortisone cream, whatever to you know help with the itching and the mosquito bites and stuff like that but i will i it, it's nothing for me to rub rub down it's like it's some alcohol to help me out when mosquitoes are like tearing me up so but that's empty this is okay this is the unstoppables for breeze fresh that i was talking about so this had two in the pack and it looks like this. This is the Febreze dual plug. So it is empty. I really enjoy this. I would always repurchase. Pretty sure I got them from either Walmart or Target. I cannot find this scent all the time. However, so sometimes it takes me a couple trips to different locations and stores to find this scent. Um, they'll have this scent in some things, but not in others. So you may have to search around a little bit or maybe your stores wherever you live at are stocked up. But I do love this scent. I currently have this same one in a um, disinfectant spray or um, what do you call it? You know, like the mist that you can clean 
and stuff with so i like i said i love this scent i really do this is a air wick and this was also two in a pack this is the um tropical mango and kiwi um i think I've, i'm currently using one of these and then i still have the other one left to use but so far i have this in my bedroom currently is that where it's at yes i have this in my bedroom plugged in and i'm enjoying it so far um but it looks like this and it does say limited edition i did find this in walmart so if you want to try this out i don't know how long it will be around but i'm enjoying the scent so far this is another clorox disinfecting wipes chris Lin lemon scent if i can talk this was my mom's i believe so she used this up around her home so that is empty this is a i don't know if this is my second one but i mentioned this one to you guys before the nudie rudy you can find this in walmart they have a bunch of different scents and i told you guys in one of my other videos there's not one scent that i haven't loved so far this is a really good brand clean ingredients um this is the berry licious scent and it really does smell just like berries this is really good i love it i would definitely repurchase if you guys have not tried out this brand nudie rudy check in walmart um like kind of in the body wash section and all that somewhere or maybe in the lotions section but you will find these and if you haven't tried them out i would definitely suggest you give them a try i love these soaps this is a as i am rice water spray this is for all hair types and it does have the rice water and biotin palmetto and ceramide in it and it looks like this So it's like a spray bottle um if you know natural girlies again you know how we you know spray our hair you know um this is good rice water rice water is good for your hair if you are not familiar with that or you haven't did your little research on it um this is good helps promote hair growth healthy hair so i was i would definitely repurchase this um i had a little bit left at the bottom that would not spray out so what i did was i just poured the little bit that was left in another smaller spray bottle so that i could kind of get to it more easily so i could use it all but this is empty this is a mini to go lysol spray i'm sure i had this in my purse or i used it like at some point during traveling or something but this is this is really good to have in your purse your work bag um if you're traveling on your carry-on if you're flying on the airplane um this is really good i think i got i mean target and walmart sell these so if you go to the travel essential section you can find this and these are good when i left my old job one of my co-workers sweet sweet lady deb um she gave me a um going away i guess gift bag and this candle was in it this is the dw home tropical sunset it's really small how many ounces this is a 3.8 ounce um candle but it looks like this and this is in the tropical sunset scent this was really good this was really strong too for this to be so small as you can see i mean i have this problem with all dw home candles the little you can see the soot and the black a part around the top but i mean I, I i don't purchase dw home candles like that you know um i just didn't have good experiences with the wicks and the tunneling and all of that and the scents weren't always that great when i purchased them in the past so would i purchase this on my own probably not but it was nice it you know i got through it pretty quickly because it was so small and the scent was pretty good so but I wouldn't purchase it on my own. I mentioned this to you guys again, but I wanted to um, put it in here to show you guys. This is the birthday cake granola. This is the great value brand, and I purchased this from Walmart. It looks like this. I use this granola, and it's so good. It has like cake, like birthday cake sprinkles and stuff in it with the granola. Um, and I usually get this and put it in my yogurt bowls. So I do, I'll do my yogurt. I put the granola in 
and then I will add whatever fruit um, that I choose, strawberries, whatever I have or whatever I want to put in there. So I usually put my granola in that. It's not, um, I mean, it's great value brand, but it's really good if you guys like granola or you eat it, um, you know, you can try it out. But this is the birthday cake. Um, I think this is like my second or third time purchasing a bag like this. So just wanted to show you guys again. If I purchase again, I probably won't put it in my empties because I've already put you guys on if you didn't know about it. These were the mini makeup remover towels. Just add water instantly wipe away makeup dirt and oil i still have two of these left um and these were from tj maxx for only 3.99 if you can see it's probably backwards but yeah i got these from tj maxx they're okay um i guess you can add your micellar water i don't know if i showed you guys the front so they the, it looked like this i mean you can find stuff like this the makeup remover towels and all that pretty much anywhere um they're okay i guess you can add your micellar water or something or i think i just would use it to add facial cleanser too and just cleanse my face like in the shower at the sink in the bathroom but i mean i guess if it works for you to remove your makeup they're cool for what they are i mean i don't know if it's something it's a staple for me and that i would use it all the time because Honestly, I really just use my hands when it comes to cleansing my face. Even if I'm using a cleansing balm or something like that, I don't really need these. So, this is a hand soap butterfly. Um, you guys know if you've watched my videos before, I am a fan of this scent. Um, my mom is too, so she likes butterfly just as much as me. But I decided to keep the hand soap. I don't even need to smell this. I decided to keep the hand soap for myself and use it. And, you know, because I did give her some of my butterfly items from here. But um, I, I decided to use the hand soap. So, sorry, Mom. But, I mean, if I see it in the store, I would purchase one for her if she wanted to try it. This was an air freshener from, um, for the car. I mean, you guys know these are the old school air fresheners, so you you may or may not still use these in your vehicles, but this was the new car scent. I can't smell nothing, so I don't know. I'm pretty sure I enjoyed it. This is one of the mini pocket bags that I probably have in here, but this is Tutti Fruity Candy. Some Bunny Loves You. Looks like this. That's empty. Um, it was pretty good. Any of the sweet scents, I do really enjoy. So, I probably would repurchase it if I saw it again. But that's an Easter scent, so I don't know. Um, this is a Glade Refill Spray. This is in the Vanilla Caramel Twist. Absolutely divine. I love this. Would repurchase. Is this limited edition? I don't know, but it's crafted with notes of creamy vanilla and golden caramel drizzle. And it just started raining. So, if you guys hear that this was really good i really did enjoy this it looks like this again this is the vanilla caramel twist really good if you're a vanilla caramel scent lover you would enjoy this if you have one of the um you guys probably can't hear it because it's further out in my home now. But um, if you always hear this in my background, um, the automatic sprayer, this is what this is for. So if you have one of these, then you can definitely try this scent out. Um, another wipes, the ones I showed you guys earlier. That's another one of those. So I go through those quite a bit. This is a mini Kleenex um, paper. I mean, I had it in my purse or something. It's just, you can buy these in a multi-pack anywhere, really. And I usually keep these in my purse, my work bag, and stuff like that. So, that's empty. This is another hand soap, Sun Wash Citrus. I mean, you guys are probably familiar with this scent. If not, sugared lemons, juicy pineapple, and mandarin. I enjoy this. It's a nice summer scent to use in the bathroom so it looks like this i would repurchase i do like that scent um this is another dish liquid this is the gain honeyberry hula scent and it looks like this again 
This is the no flip, no mess squeeze bottle. Um, this is a winterberry ice gentle foaming hand soap. Looks like this. Scent notes are ice cherries, juicy orange, and snowy lime. Finish that one. I I like this scent too. This is a put a lid on it pre-poo toilet spray, and this was in the scent lavender. I remember finding this in on clearance in was it Dollar General? And I mean, I'm gonna be honest. This is just as good as the pooper. What is it? Poopery? Like the expensive poopery? This is no different. I mean. If you want to buy that, cool. I, I bought it before in the past as well. But if you can find something like this in one of the dollar stores or um, Dollar Tree, Dollar General, or something like that, I mean, this is cheaper. It does the same thing. You, obviously, you guys know, pre-poo. So be before you go to the bathroom, just spray this, you know, before you do your business. This is really good for travel at work. You know, stuff like that as well. If you're out in public and you want to spray this before you, you know, do your business. This is the laundry sanitizer that I talked about. Um, I use either use this, the Lysol, or the Clorox in my laundry. Um, this is 0% bleach and it kills cold and flu viruses. I really started using this when the C word started. Back in, what, 2020 or something? And I haven't stopped using it since. So... As I said, either the Lysol or the Clorox, I will always purchase this and use this in my laundry. And this is the Crisp Linen Scent. This is, I had this on my stories. If you are following me on Instagram, you was, probably have saw it over there. If you're not, make sure you are. But this is the Peach Slices Deep Blemish Micro Darts. Um, these are more for if you feel a pimple forming under your skin. Um, after you do your skincare routine, you cleanse your face and everything, whatever. You apply this, leave it on overnight. It's kind of just like the pimple patches, but I think these are more centered towards the um, under the skin pimples or zits. And I think these work very well. This is my first time trying them. I was very, very pleased, and I would definitely repurchase and they look like this. I found these in Walmart, but Target probably sells them as well. This is a syrup for your coffee, uh, salted caramel. Uh, I think I purchased this from Walmart because at the time I had ran out of the ones, the skinny syrups that I buy from Marshalls or TJ Maxx. And so I got this out of Walmart. It was okay. Um, I don't think this is as big as the other ones. I don't know if I have one in here, but it was good for what it was. I mean, but if I'm at TJ Maxx or Marshalls, I will purchase those for $3.99. This is another hand soap and kitchen lemon, and this was used in the kitchen. Uh, zesty lemon, sparkling citrus, and Italian bergamot. And it looks like this. Um... I've told you guys before, I am a, a lemon scent fan, so I would definitely repurchase this. Oh, that went kind of far. Um, This is a Glade automatic spray refill. I think my mom used this because she has two of these in her home as well. I don't think I use this, but this is the Hawaiian Breeze scent crafted with notes of pineapple and plumeria. Um... It's okay. It doesn't smell bad. I mean, this wouldn't be my top pick, but, you know, whatever. She probably enjoyed it. Looks like this. Hawaiian Breeze. This is the box to a Scrub Daddy Power Paste. And I will say, I did not like this paste. It is very hard. I guess you're supposed to, from the directions, you're supposed to take the sponge that comes with it, wet it, <laughs> Y'all like how I wet it, um, put it in the paste, and then I'm guessing the paste is supposed to soften up. But listen, that was too much work for me, and the paste never softened. So I did not like it. I don't like the paste. I just kept the sponge. 
uh, zero out of 10 on the paste. I do not re recommend, but if you would like to try it yourself or you like it, then hey, kudos to you. But I did not like this paste. I just kept the scrub mommy and, you know, use it to clean or whatever. But I, I got rid of the paste. I did not like it. I would not repurchase the paste. This is, okay, so um, I want, I think these are in my Amazon storefront. These are basically the Foamin, and that is F-O-M-I-N. They are on Instagram, but I bought these on Amazon. And like I said, I believe they are in my storefront. These are basically, if I'm being 100% honest, these are basically the same thing as the Clean Skin Club towels, okay? But I wanted to try this brand because I have been seeing it on Instagram, they are basically the same thing. I think this these this company or this brand may be a few dollars cheaper than the Clean Skin Club, but they do the same thing. They serve the same purpose. But if you want to give them a try, this was the 50 count. They are disposable, eco-friendly, multi multi-use. And these towels are made from natural plant fibers. I enjoyed them. I enjoyed these. I enjoy the Clean Skin Club. So, I mean, you can take your pick. Like I said, they do the same thing. But the brand is called Foamin, F-O-M-I-N. And it's empty. There was 50 in here. And these are basically, instead of using bath towels, hand towels that carry bacteria and germs, to dry your, or wipe off your face, you use these and these are disposable ones and they're supposed to be more sanitary, um, you know. So try them out, they're in my Amazon, Amazon storefront as well. This is a glaze spray. It's, it's like a little bit left, but I think this, it stops spraying fully. But this is the Velvety Berry Bliss. This was a limited edition. And it looks like this. I did enjoy this scent. This is a mini uh, Venus Gillette, Gillette Venus, mini extra smooth. This is the on the go uh, razor and it does have five blades. This is in my like overnight, spend the night travel bag. So I haven't used this yet, but this is not my first time purchasing this. So if you need just a razor for like on the go um, or for your little bag, then this is good. But the box looks like this. And I believe I purchased this out of Target. But Walmart probably carries it as well. Five blades. It's only one razor. And it actually has like a little... I don't have it out here to show you. But it has a little case to put it in. This is the Crest Scope Clean... Okay, look. No. Crest, <laughs> Crest Scope. This is the um, Breath Freshener um, Spray. And there was two in here. I mean, y'all know what breath spray is. So if you know you don't ate some onions or whatever, and you need to freshen your breath, these are good for your purse or your work bag. Crest scope. There was two. These are good. This is definitely my mom's. This is the I glaze spray. This is the automatic spray refill, and this was in the cotton. Come on, mom. <laughs> this is the value pack Cotton Cloud Dream Limited Edition. It has notes of airy clouds and cotton. I like this scent too, but it was two in there. Don't know where the uh, actual cans are, but this is the packaging. Y'all can't read it, but that's what it is. This is a deodorant that I use. This is the new, well, it says new non-irritant and vitamin e dove men plus care and this is in the clean comfort it has 72 hour protection this is good i listen the thing fell out because <laughs> i was trying to get all of it this is good though i know it's men and i've said it before and plenty of you know already it's safe and fine for women to use men's deodorant actually men's deodorants usually smell better than the women's ones and they last you know especially during the summertime if you're out and about whatever you know you need a little extra protection but i enjoy men's deodorants not gonna lie to you guys i find that i love the scents way better than i do the women's deodorants so it's nothing for me to pick up a men's deodorant 
but just because I like to sit and it works. So this was the Dove one. Excuse the packaging looking crazy maybe, but this is the Dove Men Plus Care Clean Comfort. Would repurchase. This is the best, the best, the best, the best strawberry scented shower gel that I've ever tried in my life. The scent is just divine. This is from the Body Shop. This is the strawberry shower gel. I would definitely repurchase this over and over and over. I would purchase a big bottle if I saw it. Maybe I'll check out their website, but I enjoyed this and it looks like this. And again, this is the Body Shop strawberry shower gel. This is, I, I'm sad this, mm, mm, I mean, so good. So good. Love the shower gel. The scent is on point. If you love strawberry scents and you're looking for a strong scented shower gel, try this out. This is the Baby Dove Sensitive Skin Care Hypoallergenic Wash. This is for fragrance free. That's a mouthful. Fragrance free moisture. And I use this downstairs, but you can use it on, on your whole body. It looks like this, fragrance-free, so it's safe. If it's safe on babies, it's probably safe on you. I know that doesn't go for everything, but most things, that's it works. This is the main choice, pre-poo. It has soy milk, deep hydration. I love this stuff. I put this, it's a pre-poo. Um, you can put it on your hair uh, before you start washing it. This is like a first step before you... Jesus, before you get in the um, shower or whatever, however you wash your hair, this is from the brand Main Choice. I really like this. This is really good. It is infused with biotin and vitamins D and E. Um, I tried to, it's airing this now, but I got every last drop. This is really good. I would definitely repurchase. I'm assuming I got this out of Target, so it's probably definitely sold in there. This is a micellar cleansing water from Garnier Skin Active. This is the uh, all skin types, even sensitive. Uh, my mom used this. She loves this to use on her face and her skincare routine. She, I mean, this is probably her hundredth bottle, millionth, whatever. She likes this. This is the blue one. All skin types, even sensitive. And it, uh, of course, these all have no oil, no alcohol, and no fragrance another hand soap this is the fresh strawberry tart i remember liking this yeah this was good this was really good scent notes are fresh picked strawberries orange zest and bergamot packaging looks like this would repurchase if i saw it again this is another velvety berry bliss so the air freshener that i just showed you guys this is the glade refill spray in the same scent so i do like this scent limited edition and it looks like this uh i don't know if i use this or this was my mom's because like i said she also has a couple of these throughout her home as well this is a limited edition coffee creamer, but this isn't my first time trying this, and I do enjoy this flavor. This is Blueberry Cobbler. This is great value from Walmart. This is probably like my second or third one of this, so they seem to always have this in the store. But if you are a coffee drinker and you love blueberry flavor, I would give this a try. I do like this get some of these big things this is the tide plus ultra stain release um gentle on sensitive skin um free of dyes perfumes chlorine phosphates it looks like this um i use this mostly and i got this tip and trick from chloe yasmin i'm sure a lot of us watch her videos her channel um i use this for my underwear just being honest a lot of you know uh, us ladies as you know we have to keep it right and keep it you know ph and all that we have that to worry about downstairs and so um i know she's talked about it a lot in some of her videos but i mean it's probably an old old video but she was talking about how you know not using fragrance uh detergent 
um, you know, that on your underwear, your undergarments and stuff like that, you know, because it can mess up your pH balance. Like, you know, it's a lot of things just like you wouldn't use, uh, typically use a fragrance of a, a intimate downstairs wash with fragrance in it downstairs. Same thing goes for your underwear because you're wearing them. I mean, every day, all day, for the most part, for those of us that wear. <laughs> anyway, I use this detergent with the no, um, no dyes, no perfumes, no fragrance, all that good stuff. I use this detergent for that, okay? So this is, I mean, it doesn't always have to be tied, but as long as it doesn't have any... Um, fragrance or dyes or anything in that then i would use that um another one i have two are these the same no yes so i think my mom used these these were hers but i do use the arm and hammer i typically purchase the fresh burst but these are the clean metal scent and this is the oxy clean arm and hammer and they look like this. These are two jugs that she used. It says you can get up to 77 loads. It's okay. It's not my favorite. I think I would prefer the Fresh Burst over this. But like I said, she used these. So I guess she likes it. Alright. What is this? Nothing. Okay, this is the Starbucks Frappuccino Chill Coffee Drink. And it has eight cans. This is the caramel flavor. Um, all of destiny that, that is another channel. I love to watch. I love her videos. She put me on to these um, I got them from Walmart. These are the mini cans, but guys these are delicious <laughs> Chill coffee drink so when I make my iced coffee um, This is what I have been using recently and it looks like this you get eight cans it's the Starbucks Frappuccino, the mini ones, and it's the caramel flavor. Really good. I need to go purchase some more. I will definitely be repurchasing these. Absolutely delicious. All right. A Scrub Mommy. What is it? Sponge Mommy, but it's a Scrub Mommy, whatever. Um, this had dual-sided scrubber and sponge like all the rest. This is just a packaging. Um, I wash dishes with this one, so this is where I think I got it from Walmart. But yeah, I love Scrub Daddy, Scrub Mommy. They're all fine. All right, let me do this last. Um, this is the Poppy. Um, uh, Olipop and Poppy are very popular now. Um, I know a lot of people drink these. A lot of people love them. I purchased this variety box in Sam's Club. And if you guys shop there, I just wanted to put this in here to put you on. Um, it has 12 cans. It has four strawberry lemon, four orange, and four cherry limeade. I love these. If you shop at Sam's or you can find this variety pack anywhere else, I would definitely purchase these. These are really good. I do enjoy them. I actually have some more in the fridge right now. Not this one, but, I, you know, you can purchase them in single cans or boxes like this. So, this was good try it out if you haven't already uh speaking of that here's a olipop this was the strawberry vanilla flavor and this had this was a four pack got this from walmart um if i absolutely had to choose i prefer the poppy probably over olipop but they're both fine they both taste great to me i drink both but Poppy would probably be my fave over um, Olipop if I absolutely had to choose. What else is in here? You guys see, see, this is not even my typical um, whatever. Let me hurry up. This is why I hate letting my empties pile up like this. That was just another air freshener for the car in the car scent. Come on, come on. <laughs> All right. Is that it? All right. So, a few more po few more pocket bags. I have Ho 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 Sparkling Icicles. I don't know if you guys can see it. I have Firecracker Pop. 
and I also have champagne toast. Um, as I told you guys one time before, I don't use them by season. I use them when I get to it. So I don't care if it's Christmas, Easter, Valentine's Day, whatever the scent is, I'm going to use it. Um, this is a La Roche-Posay Purifying Foaming Cleanser. It looks like this. Um, I think they have newer packaging for this. What I will say about this, this is not my first one of these. It's a general, typical, um, regular cleanser. Um, I don't have an issue with this. I've used it and purchased it in the past. Um, I do enjoy it, but I am more focused now on using cleansers, facial cleansers that actually target something. So if you want to target acne, dark spots, blemishes, whatever, um, I, I'm more interested in purchasing and using ones that actually do something for me. This is just a basic cleanser. So if that's what you're looking for, by all means, try this. I would definitely use it again. I'm just saying it doesn't really target anything. So if you're looking for an exfoliating cleanser, um, like I said, just to target a specific thing, then this is not it. You know what I mean? But if you just want a basic cleanser, by all means, try this out. This is a very, very good brand. Very good brand. I have other things from this brand. Very good. I would use it again. This is my clarifying toner. This I got this during the Sephora sale. Very good. I would definitely repurchase. It looks like this. I think the Sephora um, Sephora items, collection items, were like 30% off at the time. And this is the clarifying toner. Really good. Would repurchase. Another sensitive skin bar, Dove sensitive skin bar. I go through these like, like crazy. This is an air freshener, limited edition, apple of my pie, glaze spray. Um, This wasn't necessarily my favorite. I just got through it and finished it. I mean, I think I would probably purchase other scents. I don't know why. I just, I don't know if it was the cinnamon or nutmeg, but this just wasn't my type of scent for the bathroom. I don't know. I probably wouldn't purchase this scent again in this. This is a, I'm still using this in the shower, but this is the Mega Babe. Shout out to Mega Babe. I really love their brand. I think I put on my stories one time that I used their thigh anti-chafe chafe, um, stick. Really good. Try it out. If you have thick thighs, save lives. Um, try that out. But this is the detoxing charcoal underarm bar. So when you want to detox your arm underarms, you know, a lot of us switch from deodorants, um, regular deodorants, aluminum free deodorants, stuff like that. Or you just want to detox your armpits. Um, this is really good. They also have a mask, but you can use this. This is just like a soap bar, but it's charcoal and it detoxes your underarms. It's called the space bar. And I got this in out of Alta. This is a shampoo, Shea Moisture is really good brand. Sure, most of you have tried them. This is the Manuka Honey and Mephora Oil Intensive Hydration Shampoo. Loved it. It is for extra dry and damaged hair. It will hydrate and replenish. I mean, they have different lines in their brand for, you know, different things. I, I, I haven't found a, a line or product from them that I really did not like. Um, I really love their shampoos, so try this one out if you haven't already. Another pocket back I missed. This is in Black Cherry Merlot. This is an Aquaphor Lip Repair, immediate relief for severely dry lips. I really love this. Um, Walmart and Target sells this, but it's like a lip balm, but this is the Aquaphor. This is a really good brand for dry skin, dry lips, whatever, you know, really good. This was a cocoa butter stick, um, Palmer's cocoa butter. Packaging looks like that. This was a, uh, Tylenol Extra Strength. This had 10 caplets. Five milligrams each, the uh, Tylenol for adults. This was in my purse or my mom's. I don't know. I think maybe it was hers. But just a mini Tylenol uh, thing. This is good for, like I said, travel, purse, work bag, if you get a headache, whatever. This is another Nudie Rudy soap. This is in the Wasabi Pear. Really enjoyed. I told you guys I love this brand. 
please check them out in Walmart. Try them out. They're soaps if you haven't already. This is from Target, and this is the Up and Up brand. This was um, two razors in it, and this is definitely five blade. Um, is it? Yeah, five blade, and this is compared to the Venus Extra Smooth. You can find these in Target, Up and Up. So these were good. All right, last but not least, I told my mom I was not going to put these in here. She was like, no, you need to let the ladies and the women know <laughs> about these panty liners. These are the Poise Daily Liners. These are in number two, very light, and they are long length. Let me show you guys. This is the box. Well, whatever. I'm pretty sure she probably purchased this box from Sam's Club Daily Liners Poise. It has 132 individually wrapped liners. My mom loves these. She said to be sure to tell you guys these keep you fresh and dry all day long. And I was like, Mom, you want me to tell your business? Like, you want me to tell them that? She was like, yes, you need to let the women know. Like, <laughs> like yes, we all wear pads. Well, not all of us, but most of us wear pads and panty liners and things like that. This is her brand, okay? She was raving about these. Um, <laughs> but what was funny, though, and she don't care because I asked her, did she want me to tell you guys? She didn't care. So, like, you know, my mom, I make her laugh a lot. And it's like, you know, she she likes to laugh. You know what I mean? So, if you tell her something funny or crack a joke or whatever, and you know how all of us have been there. Don't lie because I've been there, too. You know how, like, if you're on the verge of having to go to the restroom or, you know, it's right there on the edge and, like, somebody makes you laugh and you kind of like <laughs> let it go a little bit, you know? And it's like, she was like, yeah, you know, if I get to laughing and I accidentally whatever, you know, then these will keep you fresh and dry. <laughs> so to all my ladies and women out there that are watching this video, if you wear panty liners and you do not use this brand, my mom said, what are you doing? If you are not using these panty liners, you need to step it up, okay? Because she said to make sure I put you guys on. Again, these are the Poise Daily Liners, 10 times drier. And she said they do just that. They keep you fresh, they keep you dry, and they are excellent, superb superb 10 out of 10 recommended by my mom so you guys if you wear panty liners to my ladies make sure you try those out okay this video is already too long i apologize i i always say that i'll try not to allow my empties to get this you know piled up before i do the video so forgive me for that um thank you guys so so much for watching if you are not already subscribed to my channel, please make sure to tell a friend to tell a friend to come join us over here as well. Um, next week, I believe, my family is going on a road trip, a little mini vacay. Um, my son, his girlfriend, my brother, my, nep my nephew, you guys always hear me talk about, um, Judah. So we're doing a little family vacay. I believe it's next week. These days are starting to run together. Like we're already almost in August. But what I'm going to try to do my very best to vlog um, and record a little bit um, throughout the trip. Um, I'm going to do my best. Look, don't hold me to it. I'm not going to make any promises. But I'm going to do my very best to try to vlog and record a little bit while we're there. Um, I'll show you guys where we're at, what we're doing once we get there. Um, if I decide to do the video, but hopefully I will. I want to get into vlogging and doing a little bit more different things and just the sit downs and, you know, it's nice. It's cool. I definitely want to continue to do that. Talk about products, what I like, what I'm enjoying and that type of thing. But I also want to dib and dab in other things. So I'm going to try to vlog out and just see how it goes and how I like it. And maybe you guys will see that. Maybe you won't. But 
just in case you do make sure you stay tuned for that thank you guys so so much for watching i love you guys and until next time i will see you in my next one bye